Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. As you guys can see in the title, this is a story time. My first heartbreak. Heartbreak. Okay. So, um. By the way, guys, FYI, a girl is good. All right, and I want to make that a clear first thing first because you know me. I really, yeah, boys is not even my, you know. Yeah. Okay, I was talking to this boy. Let's say it was sixth grade. Sixth grade. Sixth grade, seventh grade. Something like that. Around like over there. Sixth grade, seventh grade, right? So basically it was this boy. You know, he's cute from my type and all of that. Not necessarily my type right now, but he cute. You feel me? He cute, he's brown skin, you know, I know me like dark skin, like dark, dark, dark skin, but he was brown skin and he was cute, like for real. So, you feel me? And he was a little older than me. He was a little older than me and I don't really talk to people my age because I feel like they too young, like they're kids. So I don't talk to people my age. I mean, he was familiar with people in the, in the hood, like by my school. And stuff like that people knew him or whatever and like you feel me i just fell in love with him <laughs> i just fell in love with him mad fast just based off looks i don't know like i just was so attracted to him so he not necessarily like he is he he like you know no hood he a little hood you feel me and you know yeah Hmm. <laughs> yeah, he a little hoodie, so you for me he would be, you know, got his got his hoodie on, got his sweats on, you know, cool fits and whatever. And like every every time I would see him, I would just be like, nah, he looked good. Like I was really feeling him. And I am not even gonna lie, I really don't know how we started talking. I don't know if his friend put him on to me. Or something I think that's what was the case but I don't really remember how we started talking all I know is that I got a big ass staring problem that's the only thing I know I got a big ass staring problem and I don't even try to do it on purpose I just feel like if you if you cute I'm gonna just be like like and I won't even know myself I feel like when it's that type of situation boys will know when I like them but boom anyways we're talking I'm feeling his vibe everything about him but it's like then again in my head all the time he ain't gonna take me serious he probably just talking to me for the moment he probably just doing this doing that entertaining me whatever I, I you feel me I'm always think that like regardless and I just with everybody cause I just don't trust nobody simple come to find out like i should have really trusted my gut because he was talking to people that was in the hood you feel me in the same area as me same surrounding same neighborhood and you feel me and it's like i'm not like this now but i used to be like a bragger like i would tell people oh my god like this boy's so cute i talked to him i would say the name and all that where i be seeing him at like oh you talk to him he was just talking to and like girl like stop trying to ruin stuff like i'm really not even feeling that i stop stop so i would hear all of that all the time and i just be like yo why you gotta do this to me like why you gotta do this to me so you know and then back then i was like a little stupid so i would just like confront him on some why you talking to this person why they saying that and he will always deny it always deny it Oh, that girl's delusional. I was talking to her mad long ago. I was talking to her mad long ago. This, that. And then, boom. That's when it came to one of the girls being my friend. Bro, one of the girls was my friend. And I found out he was talking to her. And you know what's crazy? He was talking to her friend, too. Like, it's 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 crazy. It's a really a boss head. Like, he was talking to her friend that I knew, but I wasn't really her friend but it's just so sad because it's like it's like why he getting us like that like he's violating right now talking to three people that's like for me kind of basically all know each other like he's like he did me grind me like oh my god so boom that's not even when i got my heart broke that's not even when i got my heart broke because you know i'm like 
bro they probably just being the lowest you know and stuff like that not even thinking like i just was i didn't care about what he was doing anything anything he was doing i would not care because i was like i liked him too much right so you know boom so actually this started lasting some time some time like you feel me some years you know it started um lasting some years or whatever and it was like you know things was things was okay like you feel me but the only issue was that like every time time will pass like i will really start to think to myself like you feel me like something is up like all the time i would get that feeling like and i just always ignored it like and it's just like mm -mm. to this last time you know of course i'm forgiving him over and over stuff like that and then this last time you feel me he wants some oh i okay basically okay so i gotta include this one i did get another boyfriend but we had a little stop to stuff we had a little stop to things little breaks things i'm just like nah i'm not doing this i'm not doing this no more i'm not feeling it so i got a little away from whatever we broke up and yeah you know he was always there so i get back with him or whatever same old same old same old i'm just like what am I doing? Like, I'm too young to be going through so much stress. Like, I don't have time. So, that's when this time he coming on some new type of time. And like, oh, I'm ready to start over. I want things to be different. You know, when you got that boyfriend, you got me tight. But it's like, come on, I really want to start over. Whatever, I, all that good stuff I want to hear. Like, you feel me? And the little stupid of me is coming a little out. Just a little bit. A part of me is like... Nah, I'm not doing that. But then a little stupid. Come on. <laughs> like, come on. Like, you really seen what you mean? Like, I'm so dumb when it comes to him. But for me, I give that a shot or whatever. Guys, this is where my heart falls apart. When I give him that shot, I find out he's talking to another friend of mine. He was talking, like, what did it, like, he was going crazy with my friends. Literally, like, and you know what it is, too? Every time I will find a new friend, though. A new, it be new friends, though. Not friends, because I don't really have a lot of friends, so it don't be people I knew way, way back. Every female I met talked to him. And it's a little scary. It's a little scary. I don't know if they trying to talk to me because they because they know I took ten. So it was just weird. Like after that time, I was just crying in disappointment in myself. Like I'm just like, what am I doing? What am I doing? I will block him and unblock him the same night. Like I cannot go another day without um um with keeping him blocked. So it's just like. What am I doing? Like, I don't know. I, I honestly can say I got my heart broke. But it's just like, then again, it's a lesson learned. Like, I am literally too pretty to be stupid over no boy. And y'all ladies, don't be stupid over no boy. It's really not worth it. It's really not worth it. It's it's not. Like, waste the time. Chase the bag. Chase the money. Get prettier. Look better. The, the real, for me, the real step is going to come your way. And, like, you feel me? And it's just stuff like that. You really got to be patient for your turn. Like, I feel like I was fiending to keep somebody, like, to me. Fiending to keep somebody there when you don't have to. All you really need is yourself. Like, honestly. Like, all jokes aside. Because I can honestly say I'm doing good. I've been single for over a year. And I'm doing great literally so that was the story of how i got my heart broken so make sure you like comment share this video subscribe if you haven't already and comment down some more youtube video ideas bye loves